guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I will be doing a double plan with me in my Avalon Ninth Weeks. I am obsessed with this planner. This is my content planner slash PR planner slash TPC Nation planner. All the things TPC Nation is linked down below if you're wanting to shop. Just saying. So, the last spreads, the last spread that you saw me do is this one right here this is sandy buns from planning with manny it is so cute i have not used this yet i am actually pre-filming because starting sunday the sunday before this monday i will be in florida on vacation um don't worry we're being safe we're going to spend some time on the beach with it's it's my mom and her best friend and we've been with her majority of this time so we're good. We're being safe. We're not going to go do stuff like stupid things. Um, there's obviously a pandemic going on. Um, <laughs> we will not be going and doing stupid things, but I will be in Florida. So I obviously won't be able to film in Florida because I'm not taking my stuff to film with. Um, so I'm filming now. So this is the last spread you saw. You saw me plan. It was a double plane with me. I think Yes, it was a double plane featuring Sandy Buns and Freedom from Taryn's Sticker Shop, I believe. Um, I have done a couple other spreads in between. Like I said, I'm not going to film every single one of these spreads just because it's so relaxing to just sit down and do it without having to worry about talking to me, phone, camera, people. You know what I mean. Um, so this was the May mystery sub, I believe from Taryn's sticker shop and it came with these little foil um the little foil little stickers and everything this is actually the vertical kit um but I just did everything to fit in here because it works perfectly I cut the bottom washi in half and just spread it between the two like it it worked perfectly so this is actually a full-size kit so I have a lot of leftovers but I thought it would be perfect in here. Then I actually laid this spread down last night because I wasn't sure how I was going to do it. I really wish I would have filmed this one because it's so stinking cute. This is my 90s spread. So these, everything on here came from freebies from the TPC sale in April. That was the 90s theme. All of these were freebies from that sale. I love it. I love it so much. It's heavy on the nerds and the lip smackers, but I got some nods to cucumber melon and some scrunchies, a little bit of clueless, you know, it's okay. So this will be very white space, clearly. Um, love this, love this. So that was the last spread that I laid down on to this week. So I'm actually going to be using some kit leftovers from Avalon and Knight. This was the Oh My Stars. Um, kit. So I'm going to be using that. This is what I have left over from doing an entire spread in my EC. So there's a lot of leftovers. So I'm going to be using that first. And then after that, I will be using this kit from Planner with Manny. It came in this super cute little package with the ribbon and the sticker. It's so sweet. So I actually got this during this last TPC sale. It already came in and I knew I wanted to use it so I could not wait to haul it in my um, in my haul that I upload the week of the, the next sale. So I mentioned Caitlin and got her two freebies. Um, this kit, this was the, I think this was the every, every order freebie maybe. Um, but this kit that I got is called easy peasy I believe it's so cute I thought it would be perfect for and I got the add-on um this add-on so that'll come next but I wanted to call that for you real quick because I knew I was not going to wait for the haul video that I'm actually gonna upload so I'm gonna use some washi for the Avalon and Knife kit um I'm not gonna put my date dots down yet because I purposely did not bring them up here I didn't feel like doing date dots right now. So, 
because they can kind of be a little bit of a pain. So I left them downstairs. Um, if y'all are wondering about how my office is coming, um, it's kind of on a pause. We have all of the things for my desk. Um, we're building it. I wanted a like specially made desk for me. Um, very, very personalized desk. So we have all the things to make it. It's just a matter of finding time to actually make it. So my office has kind of been put on pause, which is okay. Um, 90% of the time I'm doing stuff downstairs at my dining room table. Um, I mean, I did that for a long time. So it's not going to hurt to do it. Oh my goodness. So it's not going to hurt to do it a little bit longer. Um, yes, I would like to be up here in my office all the time. If you're wondering, I do film in my office. So I film in my floor because um, it it works and that's okay. Um, I get the best lighting up here in my office, the best natural lighting that is. Um, the rest of my house is pretty like dark and dim. It's kind of sad, but um, anyways, so um, my office is kind of just put on halt and since I'm going to Florida, I obviously won't be working on it in Florida. Um, so, you know, it's fine. While you're watching this, I am in Florida, so hopefully this goes up on time. Um, it should, because I should have it uploaded and ready to go and ready to be out. So if I don't respond to comments and stuff like that, like, immediately, just know I will get back to you as soon as I can. Um, yeah. So I'm super excited about going to Florida because I've been to the beach twice and they weren't really to just go for leisure trips. Um, they, well, the first one was, but I was two. So I don't remember going. Um, I lived on a lake my whole life. Um, my dad lived on a lake. My parents were divorced, if you did not know that. Um, they divorced when I was four. Um, but my dad and mom together, when they were married, built a house on our, um, on our city lake. And when they divorced, um, my dad kept the house. So I wish I would film one stinking video and not hit my tripod. Hopefully one day when I have a desk and I'm not sitting in the floor. Um, so yeah, since we lived on a lake, my dad always said, someone just honked their horn. Rude. Uh, <laughs> okay, so since I lived on a lake um, until I was 18, my, my dad said we didn't need to go on vacation because it was vacation all year round. That was his excuse. I, there, I mean, there was also four kids. So, vacation took, um, if we did vacation, it would take a lot of money to go. So, we never did anything. Um, like, we lived on a lake. It was fine. And then with my mom, because I did have, my parents had joint custody of me and my siblings. So... Um, my mom, instead of going on vacations, we actually went to concerts. So every summer she would take us to a concert. Typically it was Brad Paisley. Um, we went to Brad Paisley like four or five years in a row. It's crazy. Um, but I live about two, two and a half hours from St. Louis. So we would just go to St. Louis and go to concerts, um, which was fine. So we just never never vacationed so I'm really excited about going to Florida because I want a vacation <laughs> um so I grew up in a small town um I actually was supposed to go to school in an even smaller town um where my dad's house was located is technically in a different like city it's a different school district, but it's the same town 
that my mom lived in. It was, yeah, I don't know. It was weird. Um, so since I lived with my mom and my dad, we went to the, the bigger school. Um, so the bigger town, we pretty much got to pick um, what school we went to and we chose the bigger one. Um, so I lost my train of thought and that's okay. Um, don't know how I got on the subject of school. I'm sorry, it's gone. <laughs> it's been a long day. I've been painting. I've got some, the fumes maybe got to my head. I don't know. I lost my train of thought though, so. Sorry about that. I don't know where I was going with that. Um, so, back to kind of the middle of the story. I don't remember. I, I'm just gonna start putting stuff down. Just ignore me. Um, I'll talk about it in a second. Um, since I know what I'm going to talk about. The, since I was like born and raised and went to school and everything in a small town and was, I mean, I had a small group of friends. It was just, it was a small group and that was that. Small town, small everything. So whenever I got married, um, it was kind of crazy because moving to Alaska is a big deal for a small town girl like me. Um, I mean, heck, being on YouTube is a kind of a big deal. For, for me, it's crazy. Um, it's crazy to think that there are over 400 of you, like, watching these videos. I, I'm mind blown every single time I check, like, the blows my mind that there are so many people that are willing to like watch watch my hands <laughs> my, blows my mind blows my mind and this community is amazing um it's I've met so many like amazing people I haven't actually met anyone in person but I'm going to in July um <laughs> the end of July I'm going to the TPC North Carolina meetup which is a big drive. It's like 11 and a half hours. So I'm really excited about it, but it, it blows my mind that I've met, that I haven't had this my whole life because this, this community is just, it's amazing. And I learn and I grow every single day. Um, people, people I never would have met before, people I never would have even talked to before, it blows my mind that I didn't have this before. Um, like, I, what did I do with my time? Uh, like, I have made some really good friends through this journey, and I've created a lot of opportunity for myself without, without intending to. I just wanted to share, you know, what what I loved to do with the world and the fact that I, that people watch me do it blows my mind. People that give me opportunity to, to share what I love doing amazes me. It amazes me. And I'm so, so grateful for that. And I'm so grateful to have people in this community who share who share their own opinions on things and who share ways to learn and ways to grow and share their, their own spin on doing certain things. Like obviously not everyone uses this planner. I didn't know what I was going to do with the planner when I ordered it. I knew my intention was to use it as a content tracker, but I didn't know what I was going to do like layout wise or anything like that. I had no idea. And to think that people, people watch me do that and enjoy it blows my mind, blows my mind. I'm so grateful for people who, people who watch me. It's amazing that I have people that care enough about me to want to keep up with my life and ask questions 
like I like about my office and people who stuff like that it just blows my mind blows my mind I am so forever grateful for people in this community and that I've become a part of this community I am forever grateful for it so I got way sidetracked um I am using like I said back to planning um <laughs> I am using kit leftovers from Avalon and Ninth's stars are bright so this kit I got the full kit from Avalon and Ninth a long time ago a few months ago I think back in May April I think I got it in April it was a while ago um but I got it with the intention of using it no I got it in March I think it was March oh my goodness um it was a while ago uh I ordered it during one of the TPC sales of course but I got it with the intention of using it for Memorial Day I did I got a full spread in my hourly and I had a ton of leftovers and why not use them in this planner? It's literally the perfect size. I couldn't get a full spread in um, another full spread in my full size planner, but I can in this one, obviously. So we're going to go with it. So I had some glitter headers left. I kept those. The all Avalon and Ninth kits come with, ooh, I kind of want to switch those. Okay, I'm doing it. I'm switching these two. These be nice and come up. Okay, that one's good. Um, all Avalon and Ninth kits, like full kits, come with two sets of date covers. So it's literally the perfect setup for this planner um, because I don't have, I mean, you could, if you got like extras and stuff like that, you could most likely get two full spreads out of an Avalon and a kit, especially with her monthly sub, uh, monthly subscription kit. You could definitely do that. But because I don't use like, am I doing this? Yes, I'm doing this in the correct order. <laughs> I just switched it on purpose to this and then I questioned myself. So this, these leftovers were the perfect amount for a spread in this planner. So I'm gonna use one of those. I didn't pick out a full box. I have some. Um, my intention is not to make this a patriotic spread, so decide right now I Mulan would go really well actually um well I mean she has pink what do we think or should I do let's do a Taryn sticker shop one y'all know I love me some marble so why not use this right why not what's it gonna hurt not a thing so I don't really think Elsa kind of matches, Mulan kind of matches, Snow kind of matches, but they don't match like the way I want them to, so, or, 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 I could use a checklist, no, <laughs> can't make up my mind, hang on, hold please. Um, no, I'll just use this and then I'll come up with something to go to write in it or on it or I don't know. I'll figure something out. I think this will tie all the colors together. The grays. It's, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Okay. Okay. That works. Then I'll put 
little glitter header over here. I said that extremely fast. <laughs> I like wrapped it up. Okay. I flip and love it so far. Okay. So out of my leftovers, I do know that for sure Monday and Friday we'll have an upload. So I'm going to pull two pack boxes. If you were wondering, I will just, I'll just lay it down here. Um, come on. Yeah, I save like 99% of my kits for this purpose solely. Um, come on, come on, come on. I don't always have the same amount of stickers left. Like these were both, this was one kit and this was one kit. So like the functionals that I have are completely different from two Apple and I kits, but it just depends on what I use in my normal, my normal spread. So here is for one video and for Friday's video. I know that won't change. Wednesday's videos, sometimes I have a video, sometimes I don't. It just depends. So, oh no, 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 no. Okay. Friday's half box was crooked. Okay, so that's actually all I'm gonna put down right now because I don't know what else I want. I don't know if I want hap tracker or, I don't know. So that's what I'm gonna put in this week. I don't know what bows I'm using yet. I will let you know when I know. Um, so there's this spread. On to this spread. This week is the week of July 27th through August 2nd. So this will be the Planning with Manny week. I haven't decided if I want to use solid washi or the heart washi. I honestly think I'm going solid. Okay. Quick decision made. Um, so, come on, come on, come on. I'm going to put down my washi as per usual. That's the part that takes the longest. And... <laughs> Apparently, I can't get it out of itself. Um, okay, there we go. Let's do that. I am using this black washi. This is from my local grocery store um, that was in Fairbanks in Alaska. Don't live there anymore, so I can't tell you what the brand is. Um, or I would. I would let you know if I could. I love that washi very much. Um, this washi right here is glitter washi from Amazon. So that is easy to find. If you want to snag it, snag it from Amazon. Um, I'm sure you can get like thin glitter washi anywhere else, but I just got this from Amazon a long time ago when I first started planning and I use it in almost every single spread. It's not the best quality. I mean, the glitter does not come off. It's very like, what's the word? Embedded? Is that the word I'm looking for? I feel like that's the wrong word, but like it's, it doesn't come up. Um, the glitter, there's not glitter everywhere. If you know what I mean, um, I know some people have issues with their glitter washi, like the glitter coming off and going everywhere. This does not. It's very like in the in the washi. I don't know. I don't. I don't know what I'm talking about. Um. But yeah, I I really want to figure out the brand of this wash this black washi because the day I ran out of it will be very very sad day i love it so much i use it all the time and i know you guys are probably sick of seeing ali's black washi but i love it it just goes with everything okay come on oh i am so excited because i got a um custom 
Disney Terra. If you know what I'm talking about, you know what I'm talking about. If not, you're probably like, what are you talking about? Um, from Pumpkin Paper Co. It's, I've been eyeing them for a while. Um, the owner, Tara, um, hence custom Tara's, has a little character, um, little hand-drawn character called Tara. Um, and occasionally she puts out like, I don't want to say custom Tara's because I'm trying to explain what a custom Tara is. Um, occasionally she will put out a listing for a custom character. It is in the style of her custom character, Tara. Um, and this go around, it was Disney. So what we did was you get like a file and like you, you obviously you buy the listing and they are all sold out, sold out. I think the last batch was the one I ordered from because I had been eyeing them for so long and I never could commit. Um, cause I wanted one, but I didn't, but I, I got one. Um, so the, you get like a form and you fill it out and then you email it back. And then after that, after, well, whenever she finishes it, it's like, I think it's like three to four weeks or one to four weeks. I don't know. I don't know what the time frame is, but um, there's a certain time frame and once it's done, she emails you your images. So you get two PDFs, you get one of just the character and then one of the character and the castle, which is, it's not always like that. It was just like that this time because like, that was how like the, the thing was set up. You got two images. So... I got mine in today. Like I got my email with the images. Oh my gosh, I am so excited about it. I'm so excited about it. It is so cute. Oh my gosh, I can't wait to order some stickers for it because I know Beyond Paper Flowers is teamed up with Pumpkin Paper Co. And you can get your PDF image from Pumpkin Paper Co. made into stickers from Beyond Paper Flowers. And y'all know how I feel about Beyond Paper Flowers. I have a slight issue with Beyond Paper Flowers. I have a slight obsession, I should say. It's not just an issue, it's an obsession. It's a way, Beyond Paper Flowers is a way of life. <laughs> um, so I'm so excited to order some custom Disney Terra stickers from Beyond Paper Flowers. I'm so excited about it. Um, I have wanted to order from Pumpkin Paper Co. for a while. Um, I mainly order from TPC. So any shops that are in TPC, the TPC sale, what have you, that's usually where I order from. Um, I did order from Pumpkin Paper Co. though, and I'm obsessed with it. I'm so excited though that like she's teamed up with Beyond Paper Flowers because Beyond Paper Flowers, as you know, is a TPC um, shop. Like nine times out of ten, I cannot get this thing up, and I didn't bring my tweezers. Of course not. Okay, we're just gonna push through. <laughs> so Beyond Paper Flowers is nine times out of ten, if not nine and a half times out of ten, um, in the TPC sale. So she's always 30% off, by the way, during the sale. Um so I'm really excited to order from her during the sale. I am so pumped. Um like beyond pumped. It's a little kinda crazy how excited I am about this thing because it's just stickers but stickers make me so happy so yeah I'm super pumped I'm taking the date covers from the kit 
and I am lining them up right in the date cover spot. So, um, I know I did a review on this planner, but now that I'm like in it and using it, I love how customizable, like love how customizable this planner is. It's literally, you could literally do whatever you wanted with it because I'm like, there's lines and stuff like that. And there's a gap here, but if you cut that gap in half, it's literally the same size as two lines. And I love it. So it's perfect. It's the perfect, perfect, perfect planner for this size. If you, if you need a bigger size, obviously that would not be the perfect planner. That's why I have a full size planner. Um, but this, this is just, I, I love it. I love it so much. This is the Avalon and Ninth Weeks. I have the link in the description. Um, if they are out of stock, which they quite possibly could be, would not be surprised if they were out of stock because they are so amazing. Um, Amanda, the owner, restocks um, between the 6th and the 8th of the month. So check, um, check Avalon and Ninth's website and Instagram. She will keep you updated. I believe, um, when you look at the website, Avalon and Ninth.com, um, I believe when you look at the website, it like says at the very top what, or when they will be restocked. And I'm 99% sure it's the beginning, like this, the 6th through the 8th of the month. So I'm taking these headers that were right here on the date cover page. This is sheet B, if you were curious of this plan on a fanny kit. So the black and the white and the red and the polka dots and everything remind me so much of Minnie Mouse, it's not even funny. My almost two-year-old niece is obsessed with Mickey and Minnie right now, like obsessed. And because of the song, which I'm sure you've heard it, Hot Dog, the Hot Dog song, I guarantee you've heard it without even me singing the song because it's not gonna happen. Um, she's obsessed with Minnie and Mickey, but because of that song, she calls Mickey hot dog. Um, it's really cute because the first time she did it, I had no idea what she was talking about. And my sister's like, duh, it's, it's Mickey Mouse. So, but if you say, where is Mickey? She will go get him and say hot dog. Like she'll correct you. Um, but she, she knows who Mickey is. Um, she just calls him hot dog, but the black and the white and the red are like super reminding me of Mickey and Minnie right now. And it's super cute. I'm going to have to do like a dinosaur spread in here because my other niece is obsessed with dinosaurs. Like not even low key, like high key obsessed with dinosaurs. Okay, that's looking super cute so far. So let's continue. I have a little box. I have all these. I have one, two, three, four, five. Um, okay, so let's do let's do one of these up here. Let's do I kind of want this one. Well, let me wait. Okay. So the last plan with me I did, that looks down here. Okay, let's, like, uh, <laughs> okay. <laughs> let's do, nope, let's do this one up here. Because these two say the same thing, and that's okay. Um, but since they say the same thing, I went to separate them. Oh, so cute. Okay. Um, 
Okay, so I did my habit tracker next. And then the, like a deco piece. So let's see, oh, so much deco, so much deco. I love it. Um, let's do, I don't think one of the, yeah, let's do the like sour face. Manny. I think that would be really cute. Oh, yes, it would be really cute. That's because I was right. Okay, that will go there. And then Monday and Friday, we'll get... What did I do? How did I do that? Oh, goodness. Okay, I used add-ons. Okay, so let's do... This one, I thought that's kind of big. Yeah, it's kind of really big. Um, these are kind of big. Um, <laughs> that would be cute. Okay, let's do the lemonade stand for Monday's video, and I'll just write it right here. Then, now I feel like I need one that's just as big as that for Friday, right? Um, what about, I really like this, but I know I have a box with that. Is this one too big? That one, yeah, that's too big, okay. Let's do, Sour day. That might be too big. Mm. Mm. It's fine. It's fine. Okay, that's for the videos. Um, <laughs> oops. So then we can do boxes on Tuesday, Thursday. Sunday, full ones, maybe. Tuesday, Thursday, Saturday, Sunday. Okay. Let's do this one down here, this black and white one. Let's do this one on Tuesday. Okay. Then we can do, yes, we'll do this one, Thursday. Mm. Okay, that one Thursday, then, oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. No, okay. We'll do, yeah. Mm. Wait. Wait, wait, wait. Please. Please, please. Okay, this one's gonna go over here because I feel like it goes better over here. Which I felt like with all those yellow boxes, there was too much yellow going on over here. I think it broke up somehow. Okay, 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 okay. How many times can I say okay? Okay. <laughs> all right, this one's gonna go over here now. Ready? 
This one will go down here. All right, and then Wednesday can get this little guy. I said I put that one up there so I could separate these two, but oh well. It's fine, right? It's fine. Okay, that is looking adorable. Okay, so that will be all for this Playing With Me because I don't know what else I wanna put down. But here's the spread from Playing With Manny. This is called Easy Peasy. And this one right here, that's a box and tear and sticker shop bye 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 kit. And the rest, with the exception of the washi, is Avalon and Night's Stars Are Bright. So there is all for this Playing With Me. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I will see you guys in my next one. Bye guys.